There's nipple in this game. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Joel here on the Nobody Epic channel and today I am playing some GeoGuessr, the game I love to play and you kind of like to watch. I hope. I think. Maybe. I don't know. I went pro on the website. What does that mean, Joel? You went pro? Are you any better at the game? No, I am not, but I did pay the money. I got the DLC, so that means we can play these things called pro maps. Here are the popular pro maps and here are the new pro maps. Today I'm going to be doing funny views. I'm not entirely sure what that means, but we will find out. Let's start it now. All right, there's a tree in a field. This is already high comedy. It, whoa. Oh. Meh. God. Those girls are kissing. I didn't realize I was going to need this for this episode, but I'll be right back. Okay. Normally, I don't need these two things until after the episode, but I have my lotion and my Kleenex right here in case I need to moisturize or blow my load, or blow my nose. So, this is a great game, right? You gotta love GeoGuessr. I don't even know why I have headphones in. This game doesn't require sound. Let me put those down. All right, so, I don't know where we are, but it's a beautiful place. In the middle of the street, well, they're not in the middle of the street. They're on the side of the road next to a field, next to a tree, next to a field. And I don't know if these are in America, so this could be worldwide, but I'm going to assume it's the United States. I don't know. Let's look at the cars. The cars are usually a good indication. I'm sorry to have to go away from the beautiful women kissing, but the cars are generally a decent indication of where we are in the world. So that is a Mercedes truck. And I have not seen a Mercedes truck, actually. That's normally a brand you see in other countries more than in the United States. Not that Mercedes is Mercedes is Mercedes Mercedes Mercedes. Not that you don't see Mercedes in the United States. However, it is more popular in Europe. Obviously, it's a European brand. Are these cars American? I want to assume this is America and that Mercedes Mercedes. Oh, okay. Now I'm seeing Volkswagen. All right. I'm starting to think. I'm starting to think Europe. Yep, maybe. De 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 visar. De visar. This is definitely not America. Even though it looks like somewhere in the middle of Kansas. We're going to need more hints since I don't know what language that is. What does that look like? Swedish? De oh, I have some multicultural subs right now just laughing at me. Comuna. So Kesta Judd Bacow. Romania! 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 We gotta find Romania. Oh, this is gonna be even more embarrassing because I'm not entirely sure where Romania... Okay, yeah, it's right there. All right, so I think we have the country. Now we just need to get more specific. Look at this badass. Hey, man, make a left turn. If you make a left turn down there, there's something you want to see down here. I probably already saw the town name, and I have no idea where it is. If I saw the name, would I even know it's a town? Tigla Metallica. It might not even be in Romania. That just might be some sign from Romania. Coca-Cola, a global brand. And Lay's. Lay's. They got Lay's chips there. Valvoline. That's also in America. I go to Valvoline to get my oil changed. My oil. That nice Midwestern accent there that's so kind on your ears. Hey, there's a couple of grills down the road. Is Bacow a thing? I've seen that a couple of times. Cluj-Napoca. That's where Kenny S won his first major. Was that his first major? First one I saw him win. I kind of just want to guess somewhere. I don't want to be here too long. I want to see all the other funny views. I'm not seeing it. Let me let me just guess that it's slightly outside of this metro area here, and I'm embarrassed to say I don't know how to pronounce that. But actually, wait, before we do that, one last time. Hey, girls. So what was what was the origin of this? The girls were... Oh, wow. They're even hotter and heavier right here. And are they still... Oh! What? I'm gonna have to censor that. That looks like nipple. There's nipple on this game. Wow. GeoGuessr just got way cooler. There's nipple in this game. We're gonna have to leave you ladies. I hope you're enjoying your time on the side of the road in Romania. I'm gonna make a guess that we're right there. And... Ooh, 
actually really close. Not really, but 258 kilometers, kilometers, whatever you want to say, from the actual location, which is in Bacau. Bacau. Ooh, I don't know, but I didn't find it on the map. I should have seen that. Everyone watching at home is embarrassed. So let's go on to round number two. We're in some type of ski lodge. Oh, look at this dude. Does he realize he's not on the slopes and he's just inside of the lodge? I'm definitely thinking United States for this one, at least initially, because it looks like there's a lot of English. Look at this little person. Is that a mannequin? I think that's a mannequin. Yeah, based on the feet. Gonna go with mannequin. <laughs> Thought it was a person at first. Oh, what the hell? What is this? What? <laughs> Is that person walking in the door like that? Why wouldn't you just take your skis off? What is that? What is what is he being pulled by? There's nothing in here that pulls him. Whoa, okay. This is... He wasn't there before. Look at these ghost triplets right here. All three of them just walking into this haunted ski shop. Actually, I don't know if this is the United States anymore. All of these vehicles look like ones that you typically see in Europe. And I don't think I can move out of this area. I think I can only be in the, the ski shop. And I'll have to guess from here where it is. Uh, Jean-Marc Goutat. Assurances. If your name is Jean, you're probably from France. There's mountains in France, right? Where are the Alps at? There's some elevation over here, right? Let's drop it. Drop it, drop it low, girl. Drop, drop it, drop it. Let's drop it right here. Close to the border of Switzerland. And hope for the best. Make guess. Not too bad. Still got almost 4,000 points. It was in the south of France. I'm proud of myself that I was able to guess the country. I've gotten the countries correct in two straight rounds, so that's pretty good. Moving on to the next round and away from the haunted skate ski snow shop. Oh, we're on the side of the road again. Are there any? <gasps> More babes. Dang, those shorts are short. They're just jean-colored vagina covers. What is she doing? The obvious guess would be prostitution, but that's a weird place to prostitute. Let's go down the road, away from the lovely prostitute. Ultras, Livorno, so... Okay, those are not American gangs. Where is this wonderful place that women prostitute themselves to passing by vehicles next to farmland? Ikea! Where's Ikea from? Is it Switzerland? It is Switzerland. No, Sweden. Sweden. I'm sorry for getting those mixed up. Very American of me. Is this Sweden? I don't want to guess Sweden yet. Oh, Italia. I saw Italia there. Da ad though. You thought I was going to say ass. It is an ass. It is an ad as well. That's awesome. You're awesome, Europe. Casino, Livorno, Pontedera. So I believe those would be town names, right? I'm gonna guess this is an area in Italy. So let me go to Italy, a beautiful long boot. Livorno, didn't I see that somewhere? Marina Dip. oh, that's Marina de Pib Bibona. Marina de Pisa. Wow, it's gotta be close. Okay, so that probably means that it's somewhere up here or over here rather, going down. So the perspective of this driver is going down, looking this way. I hope this is close. I want over 4,000 points for this. Uh, let's just guess right here. Goodbye to the wonderful street prostitute that is living in Italy. Oh, oh, that was almost a perfect score. Oh God, yes. Eight miles away, I could walk that far. It's a wonderful prostitute. Living right here, near Costa, Costa, Costagnolo. Yeah, this is going to be my highest score ever, and I'm not playing in the United States anymore. This is so awesome. I'm so happy I paid for the DLC. Next round, four out of five. All right, please, more beautiful. What? <laughs> Oh, I was going to say, please, more beautiful women, but this is even better. Look at this gentleman. He's waiting for someone, too, clearly. Another horse companion. Two flamingos. That is a beautiful dinner date, if I've ever seen one. He also has a... Look at that. Oh, that's so cute. He's got a banana for someone else, too. He's clearly waiting for someone. What's really creepy, though, is this is like the middle of nowhere, once again. I have no idea what he's doing is this a really nice house? What? Is that an astronaut? That guy in the horse mask better watch out. There's a serial killer right on the other side of this 
very large bush. He might not even be alive anymore. This man could have been a victim of this serial killer. Very interesting starting point. I hope that horse finds his date. Let's go down the road to get some clues. Liberty Drive. Must mean we're in the United States. Plus, this is an American stop sign. And Remax is an American real estate company. A very foresty area. Actually, I think I have that horse mask. Let me look in my mask box. All right, I couldn't find the horse, but I do have a giraffe that we will use for the rest of this hunt. We'll use the power of the mask like that man did. This will bring me good luck in my hunt to find the horse masked man. That's kind of a cool little address sign on that tree there. Definitely worth it to kill a tree over putting the numbers of your house in front of your house. Hey, this tree's gonna fucking die, but people need to know what the address is here. Hopefully they're stick on and not nail. All right, I can't do this. I can't with the mask. It's too hot. I'm not a clown. I'm a man who plays video games for a job. Screw it. We'll just start at the horse and go the other way because that way isn't doing anything for me. There's something. Matheson Lake. I wish I could see the water somewhere. It's blocked by all these trees. We should just cut them down. Canadian Forest Ammo Depot. Rocky Point. So actually, this might not be the United States after all. Or at least it's a part of the United States that touches a Canadian forest. I just have no idea for this one, guys. I even called a phone number that I saw on a sign and no one answered. So we are going to guess Silver Lake Road, Maple Falls in Washington, I guess. It's near a forest. Make guess. Wow. I'm killing it right now. It was in Vancouver. That's Vancouver, right? Vancouver Island. So close. I wasn't in the same country this time, but pretty freaking close. This must be a very rich area. Northwesterners, tell me about Vancouver Island. Do rich people live there? People who wear horse masks do. I learned that today. So we're going to move on to the last round and hopefully cap off my hottest, highest score ever. Let's do it. Horse masks. Lesbians. Prostitutes. Nope, just a grumpy old lady. Get out of my town, Google. We use Bing around here, Google. We're a Bing city. Instantly, I want to say New Jersey. I don't know why. People there seem grumpy. Are these people happy to see the, the Google car? Look at the, these dudes use Bing. They're like, fuck Google. This is Bing country, motherfucker. Akron Street? Must be Ohio. It's Cleveland. Cleveland. Oh, there's big buildings down here. Go this way. I mean, it doesn't have to be Akron because there's street names of other cities in different cities, which is really weird to me always. But I still want to guess Ohio because it makes sense that that woman is probably a Cleveland Browns fan. So she's upset about her team's inability to be a successful franchise, which I can relate to. Lions fan. She's probably upset. Although she has to remember how good those Buckeyes are doing. I'm gonna call this phone number. I'm gonna blur it out for you so you don't call these people, but I'm just gonna make it easy on myself. Hi, this is Carol. Every time I try to cheat and call a phone number, nobody answers. It's gonna work one of these times though. All right, let's try calling a phone number again. It didn't work the first time. Thank you for calling Trinidad Venom After Hours. Our regular office hours are Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. If you know the Mountain. extension of the person you are trying to reach, Please press the key, followed. Mountain Standard Time? Oh, it says Mountain Views there. This isn't in Ohio. 225 North to Aurora, Colorado. Somebody say Colorado. I'm a giraffe. Okay, Aurora, Colorado. There we are. 225. Found it. Yes. Hey, Colorado, why you got an Akron Street there, huh? Right before I put in my guess here, I just remembered why I knew that Aurora was in Colorado, and it made me very sad. Colorado has had some unfortunate tragedies happen there so that's not good but let's see if we are correct just south of aurora bang 4,972 points i'm not surprised so there is a very grumpy lady that lives around here south akron street i was pretty close this has to be my best score ever let's view summary i'm so excited to see my summary 22,000 87 points out of a possible 25,000 points by far my highest score ever Thank you all for watching. I really enjoyed this if you like this video Let me know I'll talk to you guys in the comment section. We'll do more professional maps in the future Thank you all for watching and have a great day